um, this is my initial project. Um, this is stuff from like the years of me being in middle school and the work I've done since fifth grade. So I'm gonna show one piece of you, and this is um, my STEM project, and my STEM project involved making, inventing something that had to like make the environment better or do something on like an alternative resource of energy. That's what I did, and so I made like a lawnmower trailer with, instead of a gas lawnmower trailer. I put an electric lawnmower motor on a trailer I built, and then put a blade underneath it. So you pull it with the tractor and it cuts the grass. Mm -hmm. And this is my the statements I got. I told I got an A plus on the on it. No, good. Um, my presentation was a big part of it. You had how you presented it, I got, it was out of nine, I got all nines for all of the quality. Beautiful. Um, my next one is a film and timeline. This is a PowerPoint, but um, I just printed it out. I like this one because it was in social studies, and social studies is my favorite uh, subject. Oh, you like and to travel? Uh, somewhat, but um, this one shows how I can put, make pictures, oh. make pictures good, and um, it shows uh, like all the events in Rome, the big events that took place that um, involved Rome and like how they built it and when they built it and like the huge events. Um, my next one I have is my personal plan. This one is my personal favorite because it's it's my goals. This one has really, like the good friends I hang out with, what I what my goals I reach, what I want to do later in life, um, my my changes I need to make to be a better person. That one is what that shows, which I like that because I can always look back to it and. Um, my best friend, so you guys know that. So I put his as my support friend. If I need someone to go to, I can go to him. It's a lot of cool. Um, my next one is another PowerPoint. And this one is called The Knights and Jasses and Superstitions. Um, this one is... Uh, I like this one because it's bright. I made it look bright. Um, I like castles, so I kind of made it cool. Oh, and it's all in castles. So, so um, I like it because I made it bright, and it, can, it shows who You get to I bring am. these home, right? And it shows who I am and how I can make things look better and brighter in the future. And, um, yeah, I like that because of that reason. And I thought it was a cool subject to do a project on. Um, my next one is another social studies piece as well as is that too. But this one is the, um, this one is my, uh, so much Charles. Is it like this? Um, you have to choose somebody who was killed and hung in the same in which trials out of 22 people who got killed. So we had to choose people, choose a person who got hung and why they got hung. We had to write their court date, their warrants, their um, reason for it, if they were accused of like a witch, their indicaments. Um, I did Anne Perdura Dieter, I can't really pronounce her last name, but that was her. And she got hung. Yeah. And um, she was known as like a crazy person. She wasn't all there. She was a she witch. Always, she thought she saw the devil. Uh -huh. Nobody else could see it. So it was, it was, it was this one I liked. It's one of my personal favorites. It's an academic artifact. And um, this one is on stocks. We were doing $10,000. $10,000. Yeah. $10,000 to fake money um, to put towards different companies and their stocks and you had to constantly watch for seven weeks to six, six to seven weeks stocks if the stock went up if the stock went down the um the rate it went if it went down we lost money from the amount of money we put in we did two different ones um like we did certain Hey, you paid them like a couple of times. You can either do two, like this one right here. I put um, 
one share. This one I put two shares into it, so I doubled my money. So if what happens is if the stock went up, double that the money that went up, I would get double that put into my part, and then I would I could put more stocks in or I could keep the money. I that, I like this one because instead of just <laughs> random stocks, I could get across brand stocks because I like dirt bikes. So I chose um, the front. I chose. Um, Fox, Suzuki, and um, Yamaha. Oh. And those ones because um, that was a good it idea. Kind of does all because Suzuki does like racing. The Fox is the gear, and Yamaha is the brands with the dirt bikes. Mm. Um, that's all my pieces for this. And then my next one is my PowerPoint. This is this is on my work in middle school. This is on my my life, what I personally like to do. It says my name, it says style and life, and it says I like to draw like graffiti uh -huh. on paper. I chose this one because it's it says cope. And I try to cope with a lot of things. Uh -huh. It says my name and I want to learn how to I do these because I want to learn how to do it. This is these are not real. This is sidewalk. Someone drew this on the sidewalk and looking from a point of view that's what it looks like. Wow. It looks real, but it's really just a sidewalk. Yeah, very nice. Wow. My next one is this one. I like to do it by, I was supposed to put a picture of uh, video of me and Sean here, but I'm a dirt bike, but I get my phone here, so I kind of do a video. But anyways, I found my dirt bike online, so I put a picture of that, and then I wrote this my favorite, because it's fun when you feel the wind rush by you when you pull the throttle and hear it roar, which was that one. And then I like to draw. I like it because it calms me down, and it's a good coping thing to use. I do this because I was born in Boston, so that's Boston, that's my last name. And I go by Can you this, hold that up a little bit? I go by this like um quote, stay strong, keep moving forward. Very and nice. So I do that one. Um, that's pretty much the whole uh, presentation. Very good. Very good, Zach, thank you. Good job. <laughs>